this really great guy on Instagram. He is amazing. His name is Black Scraps. If you are in the LA area or even if you're not and you're traveling to LA at any point, funny ass story. I actually had no idea I was walking in to get a stick and poke tattoo, which is so ignorant of me, like so oblivious. This bitch is like literally never never on. This brain doesn't work. Stick and poke tattoos completely changed my mind about tattoos. I've had one, two, three, four, five, six machine tattoos and they've all hurt. Obviously I've gotten them done so they didn't hurt that much to the point where I stopped or anything, but stick and poke just feels so much better. I don't know, it doesn't feel like raspy, um, but again, I don't know. I feel like I always forget what the feeling is like after the fact So it's just like in the moment, but it was so like I didn't need to stop or anything It was pretty insane. Highly recommend people are gonna ask. What does it mean? Why did you get that? What is that? It's to resemble the highs and lows of life um, I just I don't know. I just wanted to get something random and I have been wanting a tattoo for a while and that's just the only kind of big meaning that I've had in this point in my life is like how life is literally this continuum rather than a, like a, a low to high moment. It's literally just frequencies of highs and lows and you feel good sometimes, you feel bad and that's not always gonna be the way it is. It's always gonna pass. Sometimes the lows are really long and sometimes the highs are really long. I also got a freaking haircut. But anyways, I'm not here to talk about that. My family just came to visit me today, which I haven't seen them in probably a month. It just felt so nice to have them in my space, like have them be in my space for once, you know? It reaffirms the belief of like, oh, I do have a family unit, like I belong to a family, you know? I don't know, sometimes it can feel really like distant and I feel very separate to my family just because of how different I am but they're still like the people I grew up with for <laughs> the majority of my life so it's just pretty insane it felt so good to have them here it just felt really good for my heart and my soul it's not very often I show my family or see my family or talk about my family but I think in the past two years I've really grown to like appreciate my family in such a different way in like such a unconditional way and I don't know it's really just been really great and healthy for me so I also haven't been able to stop listening to Blonde by Frank Ocean like I just can't stop I fucking can't um that's all I wanted to talk about today my battery's dying like always but anyways <laughs> like my tattoo like it like my tattoo Okay, also gonna watch the new episode of Scenes from a Marriage. I fucking hate Marcy, or what's her fucking name? Mary, Mari, fuck that bitch. Oscar Isaac, also get your fucking head out of your ass. That's it. You're old, sweetheart. Right. Okay. 